Hi, I'm Dr. Schaefer. I'm a sinus surgeon. We're now entering the third year of the coronavirus. But there's good news. This Omicron variant, which we're seeing in early January 2022, is much less virulent than the previous variants. Let me share with you what I've found. I see a lot of patients with sinusitis, but recently the Omicron variant of COVID-19, those symptoms mimic sinusitis. Those symptoms are nasal congestion, cough, sore throat. These patients are not that sick. They do not have high fevers, chills, night sweats, respiratory problems. They basically feel well, they just think they have their sinus infection again. But when they come in, I can tell that it's a viral infection and not a bacterial infection. And I'll share that with you how I can make that diagnosis. When I place an endoscope inside the nasal cavity, I'm trying to determine whether the patient has a bacterial, viral, or allergy as the cause of their uh, symptoms. This patient with five days of congestion, cough, and sore throat of mild degree, uh, I do not see discolored mucus. The lining of the nose is not swollen. There's minimal thick mucus in the back here, but nothing to suggest a bacterial infection. We're now looking at the nasopharynx where the coronavirus resides. I'm now using a small suction to help uh, drain the sinus, drain out the nose. This helps the patient uh, feel better and it helps me determine whether there is uh, thick mucus, discolored mucus consistent with a bacterial infection. This patient has a viral sinusitis. As opposed to this next patient, similar symptoms of five days has discolored mucus, green mucus, inflamed mucosa, bloody mucus. This patient has a bacterial infection and requires oral antibiotics. For the first patient, he was uh, confirmed to have COVID-19 on testing. I recommend for my patients that they irrigate with a salt water rinse, like a neti pod or Neil Med sinus rinse. And to that, I recommend they add less than a half teaspoon of baby shampoo, Johnson's baby shampoo. This will help break up uh, the mucus and will help kill any virus in the back of the nose. Those are my recommendations for my patients.